maybe I should do like some kind of asymmetrical thing. Is that the vibe here? Is that the move? Is this the move? Is someone gonna tell me? Tell me in the comments because there is no one to tell me in person. God forbid. Hello. Um, to be completely honest, I'm not totally sure why I decided to make this video. I just had this idea and now we're gonna do it because I don't really have much else to do today. I don't really watch Euphoria, but a lot of my best friends do and they absolutely adore it. So maybe I need to go check it out. But one of the biggest things about Euphoria is that they have very interesting high school outfits. Um, I'm in high school. We don't normally dress like that. I mean, if you do go off, like you look great, but it's just not, it's not as common as watching Euphoria would make you believe. But I do have a varied style taste. So I want to see if I can figure out a little style, a little outfit from my own closet that would fit Euphoria. You guys know that TikTok? And why aren't you in uniform? Yeah, I want to do something like that because I think it's funny. So let's, uh, let's do it. Things first, um, let's not mind the mess that is my closet. Second of all, let's just talk about what my normal style is. And it's like this plus leggings, flannels, the dresses that I wear, you could probably wear to homecoming. Like it's just, I don't think it's very euphoria. I'm sorry guys, I'm so sorry. I might have to go look online for like euphoria-esque outfits, but I do have like a shirt like this. Um, I think, is red gonna be the color I choose for this? I also have like this really cute shirt. I mean, if it's the length of Euphoria shirts, which is much shorter than I w normally wear, but you know, we can be bold, it's fine. Okay, my hair is a fluffy mess, but that's not the important part. The important part is I have my computer and Pinterest. Euphoria outfits, or just Euphoria. Whoa, I just saw like, th th there's a rave. <laughs> you know what? There's a vibe that Euphoria has that even though I haven't seen, I really appreciate. And I, my friends have been like wearing Euphoria and makeup. And I love it. My friends look amazing. That's okay. Let's see. Um, this looks like the vibe, kind of. I'm not good at this. I'm sorry. I'm not, I'm not great at fashion, which is a little unfortunate. Okay, these are like the vibes. You know what? I do have a dress that's similar to this, like, style and, and, and vibe and stuff. don't have anything like this. That actually, this looks very cute. Hmm. Okay, let's see. This is, like, a little TikTok. Skirts are in. That's good. Um, I like wearing skirts. This is a vibe. Maddie, I guess. Okay, so glitter. Do I have any glitter? We'll find out. I'm liking this. It's very club-esque, I guess. Um, I have some, like, top ideas. But I don't really know what I'm going to wear on the bottom because most of my bottoms is just plain black and leggings. I'm going to put on this shirt. I think to a degree I will be able to fit into Euphoria High School with this shirt. It's like, it's satin, it's ruched, it's cute. My cousin actually bought it for me for Halloween. So, guess who has the best cousin in the world? Me. <laughs> I decided to put jean shorts with it just as like a test. I think I'm gonna switch to black jean shorts and see how that goes. Which by the way, my heater is now on because I live in a very cold climate. So this is horrible to me. I don't mind the fact that the shirt is like unruched, but I think black jeans really are the way to go. So these are my black jeans. Also given to me by my cousin. Once again, best cousin in the world. Okay, um, now I'm just going to figure out the length on this because if I push it up too high, yes, it looks Euphoria-esque, but it also at the same time looks pretty strange. Oh, you know what? That's not as bad as I thought it was going to be. Imagine if I texted with my friends. I'm thinking Euphoria-esque, uh, like, inspired outfit. They would be so confused. They would genuinely be confused because, um, one, I don't watch the show, and two, it's not really my style. Okay, does this work? You know what, this is something I could actually get away with wearing at my actual high school. You know what, it'd be funny if a bunch of people came to school wearing like Euphoria outfits. People do a lot of like Euphoria makeup at my school, but not outfits. I vote my school should have a Euphoria day. 
Not because I like the show or watch it, but because I think it would be very entertaining and interesting to see what everyone has in their closets. Because, like, I didn't realize that I had an outfit that would end up looking like this. Because, um, by the way, I'm adding these little, like, sleevey things. That's what I'm going to call them. Yeah, sleevey things. This, this is the second one, but I can't find it. Okay. Does this work? Does this add something? Please tell me it adds something. Actually, I told myself I was going to get fishnets. And this would be a great outfit with fishnets. I actually kind of like this. Whoa! I'm liking how this is getting put together. I like red. Can you tell? Are we hitting Euphoria vibes yet? Is this happening? Am I, is, is it working? Am I doing this right? Someone tell me. I found another article of outfit that works. Knee-high boots. This is a regular part of my wardrobe. I'm not even gonna lie. Nope, that's the wrong foot. Now, now, not good at this. Okay, this is very regular in my, in my day-to-day -day life. I wear these boots all the time. But you know what? I think it's gonna fit. And again, it would look way better if I had fishnets. But I don't, because I'm a disaster, even though I keep telling myself to get fishnets, because I would wear them so often. Does this help add to the look? Because I have the sleevey things. And boots. <laughs> I mean, I'm pretty sure there were like stilettos in that show, but I don't have any stilettos, so this is where we're at. And now to do Euphoria inspired makeup because this is as good as my hair is gonna get. Euphoria inspired makeup. There was no space in that, so they're just gonna. Oh, okay. Very glittery, very wavy. I'm gonna do something that I've seen my friends do, which is a lot of glitter. And hey, would you look at that? I have glitter. And glitter is fun. There is, there is so much glitter all around me. It's so strange. done is it heavier than i normally do definitely especially the nose contour but i feel like that was a little necessary in general i think this is this is what we've decided on um this ruched red cami i guess is what i'm gonna call it and then these, I don't even know what they're, I really don't know. I've just been calling them sleeveys because that's the easiest thing. Glittery, heavy contour, nose, uh, glitter, makeup, wavy hair, latchy shorts, and knee-high boots. I think this is as close as we're gonna get to Euphoria from my outfit. So I'm really hoping that this would actually, like if I was to go to Euphoria High School, I hope that this would fly. It probably would. I think anything at that high school does. No, there's a part of me that very genuinely likes this look. Like, I think it does look really cute and cool. And I like wearing red a lot. Maybe I should put this in like a little save category and wear it when it's warmer outside. Because by the way, it's like negative outside. It is well, very well near negative. It's way under freezing. It is cold. I cannot wear this without dying outside. But hey, let's put it in the books for like spring and summer because I'm kind of liking it. Woo, wow, I didn't, I didn't think I'd enjoy this as much as I do. So the weather, yeah, that's the reason I'm not like wearing this outside of my room or my house or like not even taking pictures of it outside because uh, cold, I don't do well with the cold and I also don't do well freezing. I don't think anyone does well freezing for that matter. So that's why I'm not modeling this outside with friends at school or anything like that. Cause I don't want to freeze to death because I probably would where I live. But yeah, that's why we're, we're keeping it on a save for the spring, summer, when it's warm. Okay, that's the end of this video. Here's a really cute reversible octopus for you guys to look at while I talk. Um, that's it. I'm actually quite glad that I decided to make this video.
because whereas I have a lot of random styles in my closet, obviously by this, um, I never really put it together. Like I just am aware like this thing in my closet would be like Lumberjack in the Midwest, which is totally different. Or like there's one shirt in my closet that's very like summer, Cali girl, and then there's one that's like I am a hippie. And it's just like, it's stuff like that, or even just like casual, like I, it probably, there's probably stuff that you could look at and be like, is this girl still in middle school? No, I just wear a lot of leggings, I'm sorry. But I'm really glad that I decided to like branch out because I would not have otherwise come up with this kind of like outfit. And I really like it. And I think I really like the color red on me considering how many red shirts I apparently have. I swear, like two days ago, I had no red shirts and suddenly, one million! There's so many! <laughs> but you know, that's fine. I like wearing it. So, this is the end of the video. I hope it was entertaining. And I also think that like everyone out there should also try and come up with like Euphoria inspired outfits and makeup and stuff. Um, by the way, yes, I realize that Euphoria girls have like hair jewelry. I don't have that because I don't wear jewelry because I don't like it. But I think everyone else should do this too because it's it's a good way to like branch out your style and even and like you're not buying anything new you're just seeing what you can do with what you already have. So, I think this is a pretty cool idea. Hope you all have a wonderful day. Bye.